The recognized student organization budget roundtable was held on Wednesday, where two students discussed the changes that will be made in the upcoming year's budget structures for RSOs and RUOs. John Owens, the chairman of CSA, told us the main purpose of this budget roundtable. Um, tonight's budget roundtable was held so that we could review the various budgeting procedures with better university RSOs and our UOs and also bring them up to speed on some of the changes that have been made for this year. Kayla Lowry, student senate treasurer, talks about her disappointment with the amount of money still in the RSO's accounts at this point in the school year. I do know I'm slightly disappointed with the amount of money that's been spent with the RSO so far, so 78% of the budgets haven't been spent, so I know I'm taking those into account. My um, appropriations committee is going to take those into account. Many RSO and RUO members attended Wednesday's meeting to learn about budget changes, but CINTA president and members wanted to learn more information about how to be a part of a campus organization. Actually what we hope to gain is uh, more information about the, the budget system and uh, actually most, most of our members, I mean, I mean our executive board are new, so uh, this, this uh, meeting is important for us to, to get more information about how the budget system is working here. From members to presidents, many representatives of organizations attended Wednesday's budget roundtable meeting to learn more about what to expect from next year's budget changes. Many changes were made, but will vary from organization to organization. Reporting for CUTV News, I'm Kelsey Gestrich.